On our campus, we have a very diverse student population. Students that are from different parts of Canada, different regions of the world. Also, we have students with different abilities, disabilities, and that they have different kinds of needs in their educational setting. The Inclusive Technology Lab is a space for students to experiment with assistive technology. And assistive technology can be a huge range of things, from something like an ergonomic mouse or a digital magnifier to a type of software that allows you to control the computer completely by using voice command and not touching the keyboard at all. The Inclusive Technology Lab is a space where not only students with disabilities can get access to the kinds of technology they need, it's a space where students who are interested in learning about how inclusive technology works can engage in research projects with their faculty, without faculty members' assistance, and kind of try to understand the experience of students with disabilities and the kinds of challenges that they face. The Inclusive Technology Lab is a great place for students with disabilities to come and have access to these software and hardware. But also, at some point in the future of the university, I can imagine that these kinds of things might be available in other places around the campus as well, so that students aren't limited to just the inclusive technology lab, but that they have access to those things elsewhere. One way to look at it is evening the playing field for all students. So there are many types of technology that can assist people with things like ADHD, but also students who are blind and have something that might be considered a more traditional disability. This lab came about through a little bit of serendipity. I happened to be meeting with some donors who were interested in contributing to a new project and one of the things they were especially interested in was assistive technology. And with development's help we came across another couple who was very interested in the exact same kind of technology and wanted to contribute to the project as well. So it was a matching donation and the entire space is donor funded. The Inclusive Technology Lab has been something that's been needed on our campus for a really long time. It offers technologies to help students to be more successful at school. And it offers it in a way that is accessible and just in terms of even the hours of the library so they can access it for long periods of time.